Om Shanti, welcome back to your own channel. See the Sudha Truth Lies Within, and we're going to do the recording of 20th March of a Godly Blessing, which we have missed out. A couple of days have been missed out, and we're doing this recording. And here we're going to learn about how to become unshakable and immovable and become a detached observer. That means you're sitting on a seat and you're watching a movie and you know what is going to happen in the next scene and you're a detached observer. You're unshakable. You don't move. You don't get affected by any scenes, whether it's in your own family, amongst your family members, whether it's in your job, whether it's in your business, a loss happens or a profit happens. You are just a detached observer because you're knowledgeable, you're immovable unshakable you're not too excited in a situation when things go good and you're not too sad in a situation when things don't go as per your you're completely content because you've got this knowledge so god says may you be unshakable immovable and a conqueror of matter that means mind over matter by staying seated on the unshakable seat of a detached observer let's get into the details here whether matter creates upheaval or shows her wonderful games. Matter is even this body. A disease in this body is also an upheaval. Five elements, an earthquake comes, is also elements. So that is also matter. That is also creating upheaval. A tsunami comes, an upheaval. A typhoon comes, an upheaval. So whether matter creates upheaval or shows her wonderful games, in both situations, souls who are conquerors of matter watch everything as detached observers. They don't panic. They don't panic because they have got this knowledge. You take pleasure in watching a game, you do not get frightened, right? When you're watching a movie or you're watching a game, you are watching a football game, you are not too excited or you're not too sad because you're watching it as a detached observer. Those who are people who are wiser, they don't shout out or they don't abuse when some somebody doesn't put the ball into the goal or when somebody doesn't hit a six or a fourer in cricket so you don't get excited or you don't give out give out any kind of abuses that means you are in upheaval right you are in different states you're not neutral you can enjoy while being neutral also you can just watch the game and you can watch the movie while being neutral also can okay understand everything those who practice being seated on the unshakable seat of the stage of a detached observer cannot be shaken from their tapasya by any situation of matter or people that means people can't just come in your life and shake you and you can't say that, oh, I couldn't meditate the whole day because this person made me angry. I couldn't meditate the whole day because I didn't get this thing in my life. I wish my internet was working properly. I wish I, the fan was working or the air condition was working because I couldn't just meditate at all. We can't give those reasons, God says. <coughs> so God says then, Matter and Maya play their games of five aside, and you just have to watch as detached observers, not come into any kind of upheaval or feelings, why, when, what, why, me only. And you cannot give any reasons and or give what we call it as any excuses of why you couldn't meditate, why you couldn't be connected to God, or why you had to create upheaval in your mind. God then says, you will then be called unshakable, immovable, and conquerors of matter. So this is what we learn in Brahma Kumaris when we aspire to reach that stage on a daily basis. And it comes through practice and comes through this godly knowledge and meditation. So how do you do this is what you can learn at Brahma Kumaris. Attend the 7-day course and go ahead with this. With this Om Shanti.